drives number three, Lindwood Chance. This eighth race is the McCullough, Rossi and Company Limited Purse. There's three minutes to post, just three minutes. Maywood Park would like to offer a congratulations to Mike and Diane Erdo as they celebrate their 34th wedding anniversary right here at Maywood. Three minutes. Here's the field for the eighth, number one, Sportsmaster and Jim Curran. Number two, Cook Lomont and Daryl Bussey. Number three, Linwood Chance and a drummer change to Randy Jacobs. Number four, Baldy Jack and Ron Marsh. Five is Mr. Anthony and Dave McGee. Number six, Mark Hanover, Laverne Hostether. Number seven, Chase Tomorrow, Dale Heitman. That's the field. Now two minutes. Reach the starting gate, the gate is running. Time of the turn. Here they come. Fan pacing Linwood chance between horses. There goes Cook Lomont. Three wide. There goes Baldy Jack. Three horses in a battle for the lead. On the inside, it's Cook Lomont. Between horses, Linwood chance. It's Baldy Jack. Three wide and third. Followed in that turn by Sportsmaster. Two lengths back, Mr. Anthony. Mark Hanover and Chase tomorrow. Out of the turn. Now they saddle up the back stretch and Cook Lomont. We are in leader two lengths. It's Linwood Chance second two lengths the quarter. 28 and one the quarter. And it's Cook Lomont a length and a half. Linwood Chance closing the gap second. Sportsmaster first over on the outside. Followed by Baldy Jack, Mr. Anthony, Mark Hanover and Chase tomorrow. Approaching the half mile marker, it's Daryl Bossy and Cook Lomont. Here comes Jim Curran and Sportsmaster charging on the outside. Sportsmaster now to challenge and take command. They're halfway home. 57 and 3 and Sportsmaster opens up by three lengths. It's Cook Lamont second by two lengths. Linwood Chance takes to the outside. Baldy Jack followed on the outside. Mr. Anthony. Out of the turn, they curve into the box to Rich and Sportsmaster leads the way, but Linwood Chance digs in under a left-handed whip. Here comes Linwood Chance, now second on the outside, followed on the outside, three wide, Mr. Anthony, three horses across the track, one twenty-six and three, three horses battling for the lead, and all three can win it from here. It's Sportsmaster on the inside, Mr. Anthony, three wide between horses, Linwood Chance, Mark Hanover, he's set to go four wide. Here they come down the stretch. It's Sportsmaster with the lead. It's Mr. Anthony charging. On the outside, it's Linwood Chance. It's Sportsmaster with the lead. Sportsmaster at the wire. Number one, Sportsmaster was first. A photo for second, please hold all tickets. Let's check in at Balmoral. Racing fans, you're eight minutes away from the ninth race. This is the home roofing race. Here are your possible late doubles, coupling the eighth race winner, five incredible success with the horse and drivers of the ninth. One tonight's the night, Dean McGee, $66 even. Two Bailey's original, note the driver change now, Scott Robbins, $37.40. Three, two critical driver change, Brian Carpenter, $148.80. Four, recognized Tim Wilson, Jr., $252.80. And moving into the winner's circle, number one, Sportsmaster. Sportsmaster is owned by the Bell Valley Farms of Frankfort, Illinois, trained by Bill McEnery, and driven tonight by Jim Curran. That is a driving double for Jim Curran. This eighth race, the McCullough 
Rossi and Company Limited Purse. In the photo, number three, Linwood Chance was second. Number two, Cook Lomont third. Number six, Mark Hanover finished four.